Genesis 1, 26-27 from the message. God spoke. Let us make human beings in our image, make them reflecting our nature, so they can be responsible for the fish in the sea, the birds in the air, the cattle, and yes, earth itself, and every animal that moves on the face of earth. God created human beings. We must act now. The melting of the polar ice cap, the devastating decline in bees and other insects, the increasingly extreme weather patterns are just some of the indications that humans have a negative effect on God's creation. Individuals, communities, businesses, nations must all act now. To care for the miracle of creation is part of our calling. Look up into the skies, walk in the fields, stand at the river's edge. Everything belongs. Everything has beauty. But humanity is also part of God's creation, formed from the dust of the earth. As living beings, our life comes from the creator God. With the privilege of life on earth comes responsibility. What will we do with the breath that flows in and out from our bodies in the time that is gifted to us? Let us pray. Our Mother, who is the earth, nurturing are your ways. Your web of life be woven, your way be found within, as it is all around. Thank you this day for our daily bread and sweat and forgive us our misuse of you as we forgive others their misuse of us, and lead us not into exploitation, and deliver us from lording it over you, and over each other, and over all our other fellow creatures. For yours are the waters of life, the hills, valleys, and plains of home, the breeding, seeding, feeding ground, and for now, and for as close to forever as we will ever come. Ah, woman.